Um, last week, um, you won the consolation bracket in the ITA um, All American qualifier. Uh, could you speak about your performance and how you think that you and Gillen played as a partnership? Um, I think we started out pretty rough. Had a tough first match. It showed we were a little bit rusty. Haven't played since last May together. So lost that one, and I thought every match we played, we kind of got better as the tournament went along. But we still need to serve better and execute a bit better. But happy to get those few wins in the backdrop. Now, what can you take from those matches and applying it to this upcoming tournament? What can you like? What have you learned? Um, what can you improve on? Um, I mean, our serves are still a big issue. Kind of not a big issue, but that's kind of a key aspect of our doubles. If we get our first serves in, we move well off of it. So that's kind of big. And then we learn just just kind of make our opponents play a lot of balls. We, can, we don't have to go for anything crazy or some big shots. Just kind of make them play. Now, what are your expectations for this upcoming champ team championship tournament? Um, I mean, it's the first time I could see a lot of the guys play, and pretty much first time everyone's together. So, just looking at everyone to compete hard and play hard. We have a few, uh, I mean, a few kind of stuff we want to work on in doubles, or just expectations that we have in doubles that we want to make sure we perform. Now, what are those specific okay. expectations? Uh, yeah. I mean, just kind of like a standard, just making our opponents play a lot of balls. If we can get a racket on it, make sure we get it over the net and in the blue, just make sure to make them play a lot of balls. Now, as someone who's seemingly had a lot of success this year, whether winning the uh, Constellation Bracken or being named the OFCC Most Valuable Player, um, how do you see yourself as almost like a leader of this team? Um, how, what type of role do you play? Um, I mean, I've had pretty good results. Jared's had good results, too, and so has uh, a few other guys. So I think everyone's kind of pretty much leader on this team. And I mean, we all look at each other, so everyone has high expectations. And I feel like, yeah, I mean, it's not like an individual. Everyone's looking at me. I feel like everyone knows what they need to do. OK. Now, speaking, obviously, futuristically, with the ITA regionals coming up, uh, what do you, how do you plan on placing in that tournament? What do you want to get from that tournament? I mean, I went last year, had a pretty rough experience. And uh, yeah, I mean, we just want to do the best we can, just play our matches and just hold our standard. And I mean, if we do that, I think we'll do really well. Now playing with the Midwest region, you'll probably be facing a lot of Big Ten competition as well. How are you looking forward to uh, facing Big Ten opponents and really setting the bar to see where you guys play in the Big Ten rankings? Yeah, I mean, it'll be fun seeing all those guys again. But I mean, it's no one new, really. So we're just going to play our best and just hold our standards. OK. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you.